Hey guys, welcome back. Hope you're doing good as always. As usual, I'm also good. So friends, today we're going to see about Mick Electronics Limited and in it specifically, we're going to see about some lifetime high things that I want to share with you. Yes, clearly lifetime high because after the company has listed in the market, I mean, after the insolvency process, the company hit a high of almost 36.5 rupees to be precise. And now today's market closing is almost at 35.89 and if if it goes tomorrow into an upper circuit, it will break that price level and why it is going to be very, very important because as on today's closing, as you can see, the market capital is almost nearing to 800 crore. Okay. And one hand, yes, it is a definitely a potential share for us. We have discussed many times and now it's giving a reward to almost all the shareholders who are holding, but it is the end or whether it's a greater thing to go and what is the basic reason behind this price race if you ask me as i said to you already i'm going to say to you again it is because of the fundraise what the company is going to do almost 90 crores of fundraise which the company is going to keep it in the way of qualified institutional placement or qip or private offerings and why this is very important because the company during the uh, first listing has given some or allotted some shareholders i mean allotted some shares to certain shareholders who are termed as strategic investors and where those people have invested in this company at 20 rupees per share and now based upon the price momentum if their company want to raise 90 crores so obviously the kind of price raise or kind of issue should be placed about 90 I mean placed about 20 rupees and that's what lead to the final thing now what i can see here today is that price level computation this is a very very critical calculation that given i mean that i have dived in which i want to give to my friends also so we're going to see two base here one is price level and another is market capitalization okay and as on the closing of today the price is almost 35.89 and based upon the seen today the market capital is almost 700 crores if the market capital reaches 900 crore rupees the price level would be almost exactly at 40.63 and at 40.63 it would be almost 100 percentage rise where the non strategic where the strategic investors have invested at the beginning and what if the company's price market capitalization will reach almost 1000 crores which i said to my friends already that i am expecting the company to hit 1000 crores a long time back and at that price level it would be it would be at almost 45.14 and finally after all these things you would be having some kind of fun in your mind right what if the share price reaches 50 rupees i think i also had the same kind of ideology if mick electronics limit is going to hit 50 rupees per share in the open market then the current market capitalization would be rising to almost 100 I mean 1110 crores which is almost if we compare to the current market capitalization it is almost a rise of almost if we compare 315 crores of rise and why i believe to a certain extent that market capital can reach at least 900 to 1000 crores that brand is that the company is going to raise almost 90 crores if I compare to the 90 crores with the current market capitalization of almost 900 crores, almost a 10 percentage kind of thing. So how much you're going to allocate the share, what level you're going to allocate the share is going to be very, very important. On one hand, on a fundamental side, the company is also winning many orders from railway department specifically. And they also spoken about their EV segment. And one more thing which I'm very, very fond of is that their non-core asset by selling of land. Uh, because why I'm focusing on this point is that many people have not, the, I mean, I have, have forgot about the non-core land, what the company is having. If by any chance the company could monetize their non-core land and which the company has already said they are exploring opportunities. If they can explore any opportunities and by selling this non-core lands that can add an exceptional profit to this company. And this is regarding Microtronics price levels and if you want to check many things you can also check in this uh, social media sites I mean available um, description are given. Thank you and bye.